Welcome to this Blackpool Music School video all about the Seagull Dulcimer M4 Spruce. I tuned this to G, some people tune it to D. As long as it's tuned for this video, that's all you'll need. We are tuned G, the string nearest to your chin, D, the middle string and the pair of strings on the bottom, G again. So, let's get started. In this video we will be covering the waltz time strum. Most of the songs you'll probably play are in 4-4, four, four, counting 4 beats to the bar, 1, 2, 3, 4. In waltz time we count to 3. So, let's get started. We'll be using a G chord up here. There's several strums we can do and I'll go through a few of them now. We can do the most basic one, which is we strum down on the 1, then up on the 2-3. So it's Again, we're counting three beats to the bar. On the first beat, we're going down through the strings. On two and three, we're strumming up. I am just using my first finger as well. Down, up, up, one, two, three. Down, up, up, one, two, three. Down, up, up, one, two, three. So again, we'll do that again. Count with me, one, two, three, and we're going to strum one, two, three, 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 one, two, three. That waltz strum we've just done is a very regimented waltz strum. It doesn't really have any swing. So now we're going to add some swing. For this one, we're going to change slightly what we did. On the one, we're going to catch the top G string, the thickest G string on the one. I'm flicking it with my nail. So one, one. It doesn't really matter if you catch the other strings, if I'm honest. But if you can, just try and catch this thick G string. So it's one. Then we're going to do down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. So the count is one, two, and three, and one. Again, on the one, I'm catching that G string, on the two and three and, down, up, down, up. And of course you can combine the two strums. For this one I'll be changing the first strum slightly. On the one I'll just be catching the G string. So instead of it being one, two, three, we will now be strumming one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Again, that's one, I catch the G string, strum down on the two, three. Before we were doing one, two, three. To change that slightly now, tap the thick G string on the one, then down on the two, three. So it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. 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 So now we have that new waltz strum, we can combine two of them. So with the first bar, we're going to do one, two, three. On the next bar, again, so that's the first bar is tap, down, down, for the second bar, for the third bar, for the fourth bar, so four bars will sound like this. Again. Counting it one, two, three, one, two and three and one, two, three, one, two and three. And one. one more time.
Well, I hope you found that video useful. If you have, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to Blackpool Music Skill for more videos. For more information on Blackpool Music Skill, look in the description below. Until next time, take care, keep playing, and goodbye.